Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forge. This is episode 20. So we've managed to pick up a couple of mechs over the past few episodes, um, but not a whole lot. So if we go to mech bay here real quick, we'll have a look at what kind of parts we're looking at here. So if we go to storage, um, we go to light, we picked up an urban mech and a panther uh, 9. So that's kind of good. Now we've got enough parts in here almost to make a spider. So we've got like seven parts here till we get a spider and then like six parts till we get a commando pretty darn close uh and if we go into mediums we've got four wolverine four parts four blackjack parts so we're getting kind of close for a medium mech and heavies we've got five catapult parts and two warhammer parts so that's looking pretty good too so we're going to try and take some missions today uh maybe we can do more than one depending on how quickly it goes but we're going to try and take some missions or mission to get some stuff now if we go to the barracks real quick too uh, Pylon had enough experience here to get another skill point, so I put it on a, I put it on uh, piloting for max evasion because he's going to be right up front. So um, it's nice to have that extra little bit of evasion when you're right on, right on the front lines there. So that's all I did there. So let's go to the contracts. We just moved to this planet the other day, so we're going to have a look here. I'm thinking we're going to start at the one and a half range here, I think, and this is an assassinate in the desert. We're going to take it. A chance on this one um, I want to see if we're capable enough to do this if not we can just bail and go do something else but we're gonna try this one today I think and we're gonna negotiate and we're gonna go all the way for max salvage here uh, 199,000 in, in payout which will be nice and we're gonna deploy with our standard Lance and get this mission done all right here we go this is probably the worst assassinate map so what are we looking at here? It looks like one Lance of Defense. Am I co okay. is it correct here? Let's do this. We've got one Lance of Defenders. Doesn't look like they got any reinforcements back here. Usually they come from back here. Um, they may show up later, but maybe not. Uh, normally I like to try and make my way along here, because when this guy tries to escape, he goes up this way, right? So we're going to do the same thing today. Um, we tried this in the last series too. They spotted us when we got over here. But that was that was like later on with uh, high level, higher level um, guys. So, uh oh, I'm wondering if they do have reinforcements. So it was a little easier for them to spot us. So we're gonna just stay along the wall here. I think we should be pretty good off here, pretty well off. I guess would be the way to say it. So that's mediums. Get right up and behind this guy. It really all comes down to how good their sensors are. The last time I think we got spotted by their bodyguard over here. Yep. Right up and behind. Got it. No shooting, just running. That's right. Shooting comes later. Let's get right up and behind. Full Excellent. Okay, so this is unusual. Usually you don't get guys moving in on me so fast. So, I'm going to reserve here. I want to avoid shooting the main guy and get up and control this spot in here first. So it looks like their main guy might be a medium, because it looks like he's moved here. Or maybe it's an Orion with a command console. Wouldn't that be nice? Okay, let's start this off. Let's find out what we're up against here. I, I want to stay at distance here. Wasp, okay. Wow, one of them hit. Nice. Yeah. Hickory dickory dock. Let's blast this guy. Technology. With some merms. What's our chance to hit here? Uh, let's leave the medium lasers off. Let's go with some merms. Firing. I'm thinking we're getting lucky here Standing by. with regards to the people we're up against. Alright, let's just fire the one medium laser. I don't want to overheat too early. Wow, you hit. Nice. Now just do that when it counts. 
Okay, gonna move in. Um, just gonna go with the light rifle and the medium laser. I'm gonna save the dead. Well, we've got 25, 12, 13. We've got 13 and some odd turns of fire, so we might as well fire all. Why not? Okay, marginal damage. It's a good start. Well, he better be ace pilot or he's dead. Yep. Okay, we're going to reserve. We're going to reserve right back to the assault phase. So it's a light vehicle. Okay. Okay, let's get right up in here. Okay, we got another Chevron. Another blip, I guess. Find out next turn what, what weight scale that guy is. I need you to get in close. Another one. So that's the that's their his def up, I guess her defense. It's supposed to be a female uh, spy or, in, in, or uh, what do you, propagandist that is. Yep, that's fine. They're engaging early. That's I find that kind of interesting. I don't like going straight down the center here. It just puts too many guys on you and you don't really have a, like a, there's a nice little lip here. Plus you can get up behind rocks up here to avoid getting shot at by people down here. So, uh, we're going to reserve. See if anybody's going to be brave enough to stick their nose out. I don't think we're going to have, we're not going to have any takers. Okay, let's move into here. Position confirmed. Okay, pylon. Just gonna walk these guys up right now. There's no point in sprinting, just in case they come over the hill. You wanna be braced. Yeah, pylon, like, just walking's already got six chevrons of evasion. Yep. Kinda glad I spent that point on the, uh, let's move you here. Copy that. The point on piloting for the extra one point of max evasion. Okay, so it's just probably going to be these five. Alright, Centurion's almost in the battle. So we got two mediums, three lights. Wow, for a one and a half skull, really? Okay, we're going to reserve right back. Yeah, you know we're coming. You keep trying to flank us, buddy. Reserving action. So that was a light mech? Moving on turn three? So that command that commander better not be a light mech. I'm gonna be so upset. Okay, let's start this let's start this party off right. So what do we got here? Is this a hunchback? Yeah, we've only got like one hunchback part, I think, right now. Scorpion. How are we doing for armor on this guy? Is there a chance to hit? Pretty good. We're going to try and take the scorpion out. See if we can actually hit the scorpion. Having performance anxiety, I think. Okay, let's get in here. Can't get into the scorpion. We can MRM this guy. We'll be going before him next turn anyway. I want to position myself so that we can uh, move to a better firing position up here. We're one turn behind. I don't think Cold Metal is going to be able to go. Oh, we can do uh, indirect fire. Orders. All right, Pylon, let's get up here. No shooting. I think I want you to finish up the... Uh, let's finish up that Scorpion. 
I know he's got LRMs, but I want him gone. Oh, come on. Really, really... Since I think we're going to be ripping these guys a new one, I'm just going to indirect fire this guy. Wow. All that firepower, we couldn't kill a scorpion. Down to 18. Well, he had okay armor, I guess. 100 points is pretty good. good go. Alright, Recoil, let's finish this guy up. And we'll fire everything. Fire all that should do it. Nice, thank you. Thank you. Vehicle trash. Okay, now let's get you back here. Uh, right here, I think. Location confirmed. Just so that we're hidden. Well, I mean, the hunchback can still see us, but the rest of these guys can't. Alright, Hickory. Yep. Let's get you... Do we want to see what the other mech is? Or do we want to start working on this hunchback some more? Let's work on this hunchback some more. Not the best evasion, but we're in a good range here to fire. All weapons fire. Okay, he's a little bit unstable. If he doesn't go first, I might get... Um, oh, what do we got going on here? What's up, buddy? Okay, so... Wolverine. Nice, we got good Wolverine parts. So let's try and take that guy relatively intact if we can. So we're going to move in here. Right to there. What do we got here? That's the wasp. Alright, so this guy... Since hunchbacks have notoriously bad back armor, we're going to fire right into this guy's back. Roger. If we can actually hit. Let's see if he's sweating yet. Okay, who are you shooting at? Okay. Okay. You're upset. I get it. Okay, so Wolverine. Where'd you hit me here? CT? You hit me in the CT. Okay. So it's not too bad. Let's get to a point. Um, do I want to kill you? Uh, I'd like to try and get as much Wolverine salvage as possible, I think. So the question then becomes, what's the best way to do that? We want to hit you in the side, I think. So I think we're going to come into about here. Well, that guy can't really get behind us, I don't think. So we're going to come to about here, I think. So he can't get behind us. And we're going to do an offensive push. We're going to try and go for the leg here. We haven't had success going for headshots. So let's start on that leg if we can. What's this guy out here? Oh, good. We got a lot of leg hits. Nice. Excellent. So we're going to try and double leg that Wolverine, I think. It's really tough when you're fighting mechs that don't have a lot of armor. Oh, we have to get you second because you're... Uh, you are... Behind her. Let's get around behind this guy. And we'll leave one medium laser off. Fire the rest. Here we go. Badass. So I think we really want to just trash the hunchback. Uh, once again, oh, it's Arinia. Okay, that's almost worth trying to salvage some stuff off there. Oh, you fired in the Firefly. Good shooting, Tex. Yeah. What can I do, you fool? You can do me for this, buddy. Come over here. Okay. Let's shoot this guy in the back, eh? Two, two of those smalls off. Let's fire this guy's back. Definitely need to get this guy a TTS, man. That hunchback's panicking now. Yep, know where you can go. You're not going to get shot in the back, buddy, so... Do your best. Thanks for coming out. I'm showing minor damage. Yep. Yes, Commander. Alright, pylon. 
Uh, jeez, we gotta show our back to somebody. On my way. Let's move in here. Let's give this guy the what for. Small's not gonna be enough. Let's turn the one... Oh, we gotta turn both these guys off. Locked on. Rear armor. There we go. He's just taking a bit of a dirt nap. We can salvage that. I hope so. It's coming out of your paycheck if we can't. Okay, Wolverine. Where are you going? Okay. That's fine. Now, I can see you from there. I'm coming back here like this. And we're once again going to do an offensive push. We're going to fire at this guy. I'm going to choose the leg again. And fire everything. Okay, structure exposed, but where? Come on, show me where. Okay, so I think I'll leave my two lights up there. We're going to get Pylon back on this side to help out with the other two mechs. Thanks for coming out, buddy. Barely hit, Commander. Okay, so Wolverine is down to 54 now. We didn't take very much off that. Did a fair bit in his torso and his CT. Arm, eh. Not as much as I was hoping. So let's bring... Um... What is? What is? Which way is this guy facing now? Let's do this. Let's try and finish this guy up. We're just going to walk over here. Fire on this guy's backside. He's not having a good day. Inflicted some heavy damage. So we don't want to engage that propagandist until later. Okay, I'm thinking... Hickory, let's get over here. Can we see this... Uh, We don't have indirect fire with our MMRs, unfortunately, so we can't target the Wolverine. So let's just back up over here. Roger. Going to keep that left side facing towards this guy. And let's go this route, I think. There we go. Bye-bye. Thank you for coming out. All right, pylon. Uh, we've already pushed that guy back a turn, that's right. Okay, so let's get down in here. Good evasion. And we're going to do a cold shot in this guy's leg again. Our offensive push, I guess you want to call it. Uh, we can only fire with those, but I'm going to go with the better chance to hit here. Going to fire these guys. Oh, uh, well. Negative damage. I saw that. So, do I want to put myself in a position where that guy can shoot at me? Probably. So let's move back here. Keep our back to the wall. And we're going to try for this guy's leg again. The one thing about splash damage and going for a target like that is at least something is going to hit if you have a low percentage chance. So you'll be doing a little bit of damage anyway. He's going to make himself more unstable. So I'm hoping we can get, get a knockdown. Forty-eight. We got one hit in the leg, I think. Yeah. All right, recoil. Let's get up over here. Hey, let's see what this baby can do. Let's just pot shot this guy. Um. Roger that. Yeah. There we go. Got him into unstable. Perfect. Okay. Now hoping hoping that Hickory can get to a point where we can see the guy. No, no! I wanted to push him back another turn. Oh well. Let's get over here. All right, full speed. At least she'll have a chance to cool off a little bit. So that Wolverine's going to go now. Yep, making himself even more unstable. And heating himself up too. Okay, let's splash knock this guy down, I think. 
Um, how do I want to do this now? I'm thinking. I know I've been told several times not to do that. We're going to do this. And we're going to fire on this guy, leaving these off. And maybe we should try for a leg. What's the chance offensive push for the leg is 30? Let's try for a head hit with just the missiles. Nope. Okay, he's still stable. Ah. Orders. I don't want to kill this guy. I copy. Okay, let's do another offensive push. Let's try for this leg. Um, I'm only going to fire the one medium laser. Save some heat. Copy that. Wasn't much of a chance to hit him, but I think we can get the MMRs on him next turn and hopefully knock him down. So he's going on turn one this turn. So he doesn't have much chance. Much chance. Then we can focus on this guy. Now I want to try and get salvage off him too, because they've usually got good uh, good internals to salvage. Yeah. Don't like the looks of this. Let's do this. Confirmed. Okay, let's splash damage this guy. And we're just gonna fire. I'm on it. Okay, he's going down. So there's one pilot injury. Down to two or three. Okay. So let's get recoil around here. Speedy little recoil. No, shoot. Got it. no, we got shooting coming up, buddy. So how much do they got left in the leg here? 38. I'm going to go for the head with this guy. And I'm turning off the larger weapons and turning on all the smaller ones. And just see if we can get a head hit with these guys. Is that enough for the leg? Where did that pan? Was that both in the leg? Nope. Okay, pylon. Let's move up here. I'm starting to get worried now. I don't want to lose the salvage on this guy. So let's do... This. Engaging target. Is that a leg hit? What was that? What are you shooting at? Torso. Really? Really? Ugh. Okay, we gotta move. Oh, shit. Did not mean to do that. Damn it. Damn it. Well, if we can claim this leg next turn in the torso, that'll be a pilot injury and a knockdown. And that should kill him. In theory. And I think I'm going to turn that over to recoil. Oh, well, he shut down. That's good. That's going to make things easy. Okay. I'm going to do something a little different now. Uh, recoil. I think that guy over there is gone. So we're going to change paces here a little bit. We're going to start shooting on this guy. We're going to push him back a turn. And we're just going to shoot with the smalls. Yep, I know he's taking damage. All right, next thing we're going to do is that guy goes on turn three. He's going to restart. So we need to do shoot. I think I made a mistake there. Okay, so let's leave the MRMs off. Going to go with the medium lasers. Fire on this guy. Going to go for leg shot. And hope we get lucky. There's the torso. That's good. Is it a knockdown? No. Nope. Oh, yeah. You needed No, it's not. Oh yeah, we needed the leg, lady. Okay, so he powered up. Pylon. Actually, nope. We're gonna do cold metal first. Because I wanna push. Do I wanna push that guy back? I don't think it really matters which way to go now, because he's going again anyway. He's going on next turn anyway. So 
Let's just move up. Gonna target this guy. Fire everything. Let's get this guy started. You didn't move far enough. We're coming for you. Oh, that guy's in trouble. Good to go. All right, pylon. We're not going to move this turn. Uh, definitely need to get this guy's leg. How much left in the CT? 80? Okay, we're going to go for the leg. I should be safe with this many. Hopefully we get it. Got it. Oh, we got it. There it is, and we're going to get some salvage from the Wolverine. Oh, yeah. Good night. All right, let's block this guy's escape route now. Roger that. That's all he can do this turn. Right here. So we're going to definitely need to move. Got a bit of this left, so we're going to use this. I want to go twice before he gets to go. And Hickory. Yeah. So let's just come down to here and keep that left side turned towards him. And since you got the missiles, let's use them. Going to go for a headshot. Ah, oh, the weapon mount got destroyed. Damn. How did that taste? You're destroying all of our salvage. Okay, I'm going to move in slightly. Better chances to hit. Do an offensive push. Look for the headshot. We're going to end up killing this guy. Damn. All right, pylon. It's getting close. Moving to position. Let's just shoot at him. Let's just finish this up, guys. Oh, was that a head hit? Sure looked like it was. It was. Nice. Solid connection. Our target is making a oh, he ain't going nowhere. Gonna go for that headshot again. Let's clean this up. Come on. <laughs> like that, do you? Yeah, I want you to move in closer. Better chance to hit his head. Let's go. Is that a head hit? Oh, no. Are we out of... Well, we got one left. Let's go for that head shot. Come on. Take the head off. Take the head off. Come on. Ugh. See if we can knock his ass on the ground. Gonna attack him from behind, so I don't want to blow him up. But I can avoid it. Whoops. Sorry, my bad. Mech destroyed. Mission. Okay, we're definitely gonna need to get called shot bonus, I think. That's kind of paramount. So we increased our um, pay by 45%, so we made some good coin today. Barely took any damage. Centurion took a bit in the CT here. A um, little bit on the Firefly. All right, so here's all the juicy salvage we have a chance to get. Look at all these Wolverine parts. Excellent. So let's hope we get a few of them. Uh, what do we got down here? Snubnose PPC, Endo Steel. Do we still need Endo Steel? I think Gyro is probably more important. I can't remember if we still need Endo Steel or not. Oh. Oh, well. Oh, this is nice too. Oh, Warfare Suite. No, I can't decide now what I want. Plus two arm accuracy. Where would that go? Warfare Suite. Definitely good. Evasion pips. Accuracy with weapons. Targeting computer. That's for the head. Right? Plus one accuracy. Oh, I can't decide. Stealth system. What am I going to get the most use out of, though? 
Stealth is pretty good. Could definitely use that on the Firefly. Or does the Firefly already have that? I can't even remember now. Um, my god. Targeting computer, I think. Let's hope for some of this stuff. Oh, we got two Wolverine parts. Oh my god, that's awesome. Okay, great. So we got the Stundos PPC. Excellent. Endo Steel. We did really well this time. Alright, so there's our financial statement, 226. We easily made that in this battle. Alright, 27,000. So that's pretty much all the money we made in the battle gone. So we were, we're up a lot of stuff here. Cool. So let's check our tasks. And we're going to move the Centurion up. So we'll have a total of six days. Alright, so let's get these guys repaired here. And let's have a look now in the mech base, see what we can do with these guys. I, don't, I think we've got Endo Steel and everybody already. No, the, the uh, Firefly needs it. And Centurion is good. And we got the Nis in there. And Jenner. Jenner could definitely use... Well, no, it's got the heavy fire, Pharaoh, so... This has just got Pharaoh Fibrous Armor. Let's have a look at... It's got a heavy Gyro, too. Um... Grants and Trents when walking. Let's refit this guy. I'm thinking... Heavy Gyro. Tonnage minus one. So if we do this... Pull the Pharaoh. Go to Equipment. We definitely need an ECM in here for sure. Uh, so let's have a look now, and maybe we put the um, XL Gyro in? We don't have the room. Do we just have a basic, this is a basic ECM suite? It is a one ton ECM. Oh, we already have a Guardian ECM in the head, so we don't need an ECM. Excellent. So we could do, um, where's the NIS here? Uh, oh, we no, we didn't take it. That's right. Oh, right. I don't know what I'm thinking. Let's just leave this guy how he was then. Yeah, dang. Wasn't thinking. Let's just go back. Okay, we got an XL gyro in there. What do we got in here? Angel ECM. Let's have a look at this guy. So if we put, let's go to equipment. If we put, um, is the X, is the XL gyro, forty stability. So this is okay. Here it's going to go only give us one ton though. Um, got the Angel ECM in here. How much is this way? Two tons. So it's probably better than. Yeah, it's still better. One extra ton, eh? We could go with another heat sink, but we're pretty good right now, except for on hot planets. Um, we got the DNI cockpit still, too. Minus 10% damage taken. Um. Yeah, I don't think really if one ton. We can't upgrade the weapons at all. We don't have any pulse lasers. It would be nice to remove like a regular laser and put a pulse laser in it, but um, I don't think there's really anything. Yeah, so let's just leave it out of this guy. I don't know what else we could do with it. I was so excited to get that gyro, and now I'm thinking the NSS would have been better. We lost a lot out of this guy, so let's see if we can do something about this. So let's put in, um, where are we here? Here we go. If we do this, we got one ton on this guy. His heat sinking isn't really the greatest. So we could throw in like the cooling pod or something. That'll greatly increase efficiency. 
probably going to go that route, I think. Let's just confirm that. It's only one day. Right. And then we're going to go to the Centurion. And let's get that targeting computer in here. Uh, injury cockpit can come out. And let's go to equipment. And where's our targeting computer here? Targeting computer, definitely want to throw it in here. So let's confirm this. And do we have a cockpit on here? We don't. So I'm thinking Phoenix Hawks got single injury cockpit. I think the Phoenix Hawks probably more important. So let's take the single injury cockpit off of there and throw in two things. We're going to put the patchwork in and we're going to put, let's actually, let's put this guy down. Let's put it in the center torso. Actually, let's put it up here. And then we're going to put in the double injury cockpit upgrade. And we're going to upgrade the armor slightly. We got like four points, five points we can put on. So like one, two, three, four, four points. So it's a little better, not much, but still better than not having anything else. So that's good. Confirm that. And then in the flea, since this guy's up front a lot, we can do a couple things here now. So let's go to equipment. We're going to get that injury cockpit in here for sure. Can we get the endo steel in? No, we can't. We don't have enough dynamic slots. So if we decide to, let's say, pull out, we can't pull out the double heat sinks. Um, How many slots did it say we needed? Four additional free slots. It's not going to help us in any way. I mean, we got this guy loaded down with weapons. So what if we go to weapons here? Change things up a little bit. So what if we pull out two small lasers and put another medium in instead? That's going to give us another space. If we pull out two heat sinks, let's say, and go to equipment and put an exchanger in, then we can probably take out... What's our heat efficiency here at? Yeah, we're really good for heat efficiency. So this heat sink can come out too. We can get the endo steel in. And then we've got one slot left. So let's do... Our heat efficiency at right now. We can put a whole nother medium laser in here. So we could take, or even put a triple plus flamer in. That's a possibility. Targets generate plus five heat for two turns. We don't really have anything here we can use. Like we could throw another, we could throw a flamer in here. Or is the medium laser going to be way more beneficial? But bonus versus overheat. I mean... Let's try it with this. Oh, we still got tons of tonnage left. How does that happen? Let's take out the XL engine. Because that's just going to get us killed. If we do that, what are we looking at here? Sick, we're flush. So if we pull the, we could just throw a regular heat sink back in even. We could give us a little extra heat dispersion for those hot planets. That's actually pretty darn good. Guardian ECM, this is just what, the general ECM? We have a better one. That's the other possibility. Um, mask, yeah, that would be crazy. We got a—that's the guardian. That's the one we have, 1.5. So we don't really have anything else. Ballistic accuracy, we can't really use. We need to get energy accuracy. Is what we need for sure. Um, the one thing we haven't done is check the store on this planet. Let's just do that real quick. So let's have a quick look. Er large. LRM5 NARC is kind of nice. Nice. LRM15, some mag shots. 
Uh, Plasma Torch, Thunderbolt 5, nah. Yep, not a lot. TTS Ballistic plus two. What figures? Why can't we get an energy one? Man, come on. Um, any interesting LRM ammo? There's Ar Arteris 4 ammo. SRM bonus to hit arm uh, ammo. We're going to be finding a lot more of that coming up. So I think we'll just confirm this. And we will get our mechs back. Time when we come back, we're going to engage with a much better lance here, I think. So let's manage our tasks a little better. Uh, let's get you up here and a you here. So it'll be like four days, I think. Four days. It says five, but it's going to be four. Boom, four days. All right, so next time when we come back, we're going to hit the planet and we're going to hit it hard. All right, so if you like the episode, please drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and check out my other series too. Uh, you can check them out on my channel. I've got two other series going on, a Battletech Flashpoint series and another Rogue Tech series. So check those out. Until next time, we'll see you all later.